Malu van Rijn, the reigning world and Paralympic champion, Jussi Versace, double medalist in the Europeans and Grisetto. Fabulous CV. But they don't get much more marvelous than Malu van Rijn. The 200 meters champion at London 2012. Did the double in the last two World Championships in Lyon and Doha and the Europeans in Swansea in between. The Netherlands were not at this year's Europeans. Saki Takakua, who was fifth in the long jump here, bronze in the Asian Games in 2014 for Japan from Tokyo. In lane six will be uh, Marissa Papa Constantino. For Canada, Juicy Versace. A silver in the two, bronze in the four at the Europeans of Grosseto, the winner of the Italian Dancing with the Stars, has her own sports program on Italian TV on Sunday nights. For Mita Akinabaku, the United States, in four, the championship debut, Abbasio Rapmani, European bronze medalist in the 100 for Switzerland in three, and Liz Willis, USA, in lane two. So Willis, Rapmani, Ayimbeku, Versace, Papa Constantino, Takakua, and Malu Van Ryan. Top three to go through. It's a lot of focus on Van Ryan, but she just stayed in the blocks a little bit. Takaku was shot away here for Japan. What a start by her. Papa Constantino is going very well also for Canada out of lane six. So Van Ryan has got to get motoring here in the closing straight, and she does. Here she comes, Marlu Van Rijn, the world record holder, the Paralympic champion, the world champion, is going to win this 26-70, and she takes it well. And a big margin of victory for Marlu Van Rijn in the end. It took her a while to get out of the blocks, but once she did, she got chucking very well. 26-69, it's been rounded down to. Very impressive start, actually, by Takakua, I must say, Rachmani. It's true in second place, a lifetime best for Switzerland with 27.89. And Papa Constantino did indeed take third in the end with a lifetime best, 28.11. But Marlou Van Rijn's the one that they all have to beat. Ben Suzanne clocking a 26.70 Paralympic record in the first seat, but she's a different category to Van Rijn. Took her a while to get going. Just look at how well Takakua had done by there, but began to fall back. Then Papa Constantinou from Canada moving up. Ayan Beku was flying very well for the United States at that stage as well. Rachmani moving up, you'll see in second place, but Van Rijn, look at that margin of victory. Eyes only for her around the Sensenau Stadium. Well, it's a good sign of a champion when you can switch it on and switch it off. And the acceleration was outstanding. Just taking a little bit of time, as we do see with the double bladers, just to get motoring. But she was able to switch off near the line, and it will be a great final. With Lefer there, Van Ryan, all the big names are through, and look how comfortable it was. Again, wouldn't blow out a candle. Looking so comfortable as she just glances over to the big screen. Uh, she enjoyed that. Had to put a bit of effort in the closing straight. Papa Constantino has been disqualified, actually. So, Juicy Versace goes through along with Rachmani and Van Rijn. And Ayan Bengu and Takakua through also.